This formation we're on at the present time is known as the open box formation. We have two guys in point, two guys in the rear, giving us 360 degrees protection. Myself and the personal protection officer for the VIP. This is great. It allows the VIP access to the public. It's good for image, but it is very, very poor for security. Seven. Ah! Get down! Although this formation is great for the VIP's image, it allowed an attacker to get into the inner core of the close protection team. This formation we're in at the moment is known as the closed box formation. VIPs don't like it because they can't be seen by the public. It's very good for security, but... Grenade! Get down! If someone throws a grenade or an explosive device into the close protection team, we have no option but to get the VIP in the ground and cover her with her bodies. This formation is the one preferred by both the VIP and the close protection team. It's an easily adaptable formation and gives us good all-round arcs of fire. We've got a point man who's able to watch to the front and down the left hand and right hand side of any crowd. We've got myself positioned beside the VIP offering personal protection to her, but also able to observe to my left and to my right. To my right, I've got John Mack covering to his right and also offering protection to the VIP if necessary. On the left-hand arm of the V, we have Johnny. He's watching to the rear and also watching down the left-hand flank of the formation. On the right-hand arm of the V, we have Pete. He can also watch to the rear and watch down the right-hand side of the formation. This formation allows us to withstand a simultaneous attack from both sides.